I, I just had my movie Legally Blondes that just aired on ABC Family and then it's airing on Disney later in September. And I was the mean girl. And then uh, my new. You were the mean girl? I was the mean girl, yeah. I can't believe that. Thank you, I appreciate that. But I was quite mean. Um, really? Yeah, really mean. How but mean the meanest thing you did? How mean were you? What's the meanest What's thing you did? I, 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 two sisters, I manipulated them, I, tr I pretended to befriend them, and then I split them, and I tried to destroy their relationship and their reputation, and I tried to get them, wait, I can't say all this. Is oh, that oh, so oh. you could steal a boyfriend? No, actually. Nothing? It was not that, but they, they started stealing mine. Really? Which we could That's not That's retribution? I, no, well, what they weren't even the trying, the boy just liked them better than me. What an idiot. I thank you. Gee, I can't believe that. <laughs> I know, George. What a crazy. He was blind. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Now, now, yeah, George, now we're, gonna, the, now we're going to find idea. out. Brittany, we're going to find out how much you actually learned from doing that show. Now, if you were going to be really mean to George, what would you do? What would I do? Oh, turn around. I would pretend to be his friend, and then I would destroy him through our friendship. Oh. That's not very nice. See, no. See the manipulation that's happening right now? Yep. You're really sick. <laughs> <laughs> Best way to destroy somebody is to become their friend first. Right? Not what? that I have done that. But but you don't see those things from movies. So if I actually ask you to put this on your finger, demonstrate it to the world for us. Okay, right, see? There's a phone in my hand. Would you do it? I am. That it's not falling. So nice of you. That's Moby Grip. <laughs> A safety belt for cell phones. A safety belt for cell phones? And the best branding device for celebrity in the world. Face goes on there, distributed globally. I noticed yep. you gave her a wild one, Not an it. animal print. Is that supposed to mean anything, Brittany? No. I thought you had a mirror one. Didn't you want a mirror? He's a liar. No. Uh -huh. I didn't get a mirror. Wait. I got a black one. See, when paparazzi takes a picture of your face, you hold this up. And the mirror flashes right back at him, and they uh, see you that's at funny. all. That's funny. I like that. Now she wants another one. See? Maybe I do want or a mirror. Or if you're being trailed, you're going to let your ball and see you right in your back. I'm going to give you a mirror. I could use that. Do you have a mirror one? Really? I thought you were being sarcastic about that. <laughs> you're my best friend. Now watch that's me right. set you up and then crumble you to your knees. Now, Brittany, while he's looking for all those in his pocket, uh huh. What? Are, of course, I did. What are you wearing? It's a great outfit. Sweet. Wait, Joyce has a question. What are you wearing? It's gorgeous. I'm wearing uh, Lorena Sarbu. It's this great designer. Um, I think this is. They're out of Beverly Hills, but I think the dress was made in um, Italy. And I, they have very cool, different stuff. And then. Emerald green. Yeah. It's very beautiful. Oh, really? Oh, well, that's good. That's what we were going for. So, Brittany, I understand you're going to be in a music video with oh, Tiana. Yeah, yes. yeah. Wow. Yeah, wow. Next week. It worked out because my, my new show, Men of a Certain Age, we were supposed to start filming next week, but um, now we got pushed back a few days. And so now I actually might have time to do the music video. I really hope so because their performance, yeah. like, I don't understand how they can go that long, like dancing and singing without passing out from exhaustion. Yeah. But they were really good. They're such sweet guys. Good. I, they were such cool guys. Uh oh, he's finding something for you, George. There's a mirror. Oh, let's see. See that when the works, paparazzi it takes me. a shot, you flash it right back in their face. I got it. I got the camera. <laughs> I know how to do it now. Now, wait a minute. Now, seeing George right here, your new show with Ray Romano, Men of a Certain Age. Should I ask you if that gives you any ideas? I feel like I'm Ray's father. Yeah, oh, no. Standing right next to this lady. <laughs> Beautiful girl. He's your dad. Yeah, Ray I'm his, telling I you, I daughter. could be his dad. No, no, I don't think so. Don't, don't okay. think so. Yeah, Ray's a really cool guy. I know. He's yeah. funny. He's one of the funniest guys he on is. TV. Yep, he is. Are you supposed to turn around his funniness or you have to set up one? I'm, well, it's, it's, a, it's a one hour dramedy, so it's not like uh, set up, set up, set up, punchline. You know what I mean? It's much more right. the comedy comes out of the, uh, the realistic situations. So do you play off of him or he plays off of you or both? Uh, well, I mean, he, I, I think he's funnier than I am. But I've only read the first two scripts, so we have yet to see. But we both have really, we both have really good funny lines. You have a very good I can tell. You, you're, you carry yourself. Oh, thank very you. Good. So, I think you're very quick. Okay. Quick, quick.
So very, very much. Yeah, thank you guys. Yeah, thank you guys. Bye. Bye, Brandon.